in this video I will be explaining about the approval process so I want to create an approval process for the discount field the opportunity object in order to do that I have already created a discount field on the opportunity object push that go into the approval process and select the object that you need to process for select opportunity when we try to create a new process always try to use the standard setup method which I've already done and let me show you so yeah when you when you select the standard setup wizard this is the page you'd get into and you enter the process name and then the criteria will select the opportunity discount the particular field is greater than 25 click on next everything remains unchanged here then click on next again here we have select the template email template so i have selected the one that is already existing marketing product inquiry response you click on next i have selected these fields to be displayed on the layout and then also check mark on the display approval history information in addition to the field selected above let me click on next here everything remains unchanged here step 6 click on save we have another step here wherein we go to the approval steps and enter the name as discount create it basically we are creating an approval process step so for that we'll, ex we'll enter the name as discount greater than 25% click on next same thing we will enter the field as the opposite discount greater than end the value Here we would select the user, I mean who would be the approver. So I've selected the one existing already. So try to save it. Now what we do is we try the step, the approval process and the step approval process step has been created. So now we go ahead and activate the step. Now the step has been successfully activated. Go to the front end. Go to the sales app. Then the opportunities we try to create a new opportunity. The amount would be what 100k. Select a close date. Put in the opportunity name. We'll enter it as value proposition since the stage field is mandatory and now discount we will put in as 30% because it has to be about 25% for the rule to get triggered we will check for any mandatory fields that are needed nothing is needed so we will go ahead and save so once the record is saved you will see that will be displayed in stage history and will be nothing in the approval history unless until it is sent for approval we will enter the comments here submit it for approval now what we'll do is we'll go into the user we'll log in into the user the alco admin and now from here 
the nine dots will select approval request This is the test record that has been created. It has been sent for the approval by the administrator. And now here the approver gets three options whether to approve, reject or reassign. Status is still pending. Go ahead and approve it. That's quite simple and now you can see the status has changed from pending to approved. I can refresh this. In the approval history you can clearly see what time it has been approved and all other details. 